Hi all, in this video I will show you how to create gem links in your WordPress blog. Gem links is also known as angle links. It is a nice and effective way to link one part of your content to another. The link source and destination can be in same or different post. I can show you a demo of gem links using a test post in my WordPress blog. .netmob.com is my programming blog for developers. This is the test post from the blog with dummy contents. In this post, there are three subheadings. And the post start with table of contents. Each subheading is hyperlinked into their corresponding sections. If you click on Heading 1, it will bring the corresponding setting section into visibility of the browser. Then heading 2 and heading 3. At the end of the post, you can see a go to top hyperlink. If you click on that, you can see the top of the post. And if you want to link another article or post from this post using angle link it is also possible here we have done that you can see like this the from this post here we have linked this post with angle link so it will directly show the corresponding anchor link section into the visibility of the browser if you link a post without using any anchor links you will be shown the beginning of the article let's look how it can be done using anchor links in wordpress I have opened the test post in edit mode in WordPress. First of all, we need to mark the area of the post where we want to link the hyperlink. It can be done in two ways. First one is using anchor tags and second one is using the ID attribute in HTML. Now we need to mark the areas of the post with anchor tag or HTML ID attribute. So first of all, we need to mark the top of the post with anchor tag. For that, place the cursor in the first layer and go to insert. Then click on anchor. Give a name for the anchor. It should be unique and the and better remove space between the name so I am going to give some um, let it be top then click on ok then you can see a angle symbol here like this we need to mark other areas like this We can mark this heading 3 using anchor tag and also using the uh, ID attribute in HTML. You can use HTML ID attribute to mark the area if you have HTML basics. If you are not familiar with HTML, we can use anchor tags. For marking, 
with HTML ID attribute. We need to edit the HTML code for that. Go to text mode. Then heading three. Give the we can mark this heading with ID attribute as heading three. Okay. In the demo, I have shown that this reference is is referenced is linked to another post so we have to add one anger tag there also that is uh, this one so mark creating a new anger tag click on ok so we have marked all the sections now we need to link these anger tags using hyperlink it can be done in in one step so select the heading then click on insert or edit link then we need to add one hashtag then the anger name that we have given for this heading that was heading one then apply then for heading two place in a place one hashtag before the anchor name then apply then heading 3 this heading is heading 3 is mark using HTML ID attribute can be linked in the same way as we have done the anchor tag then we have go to top select the text then click on this hyper link button then place one hashtag then type top then apply then for this there is some twist since the destination post is different select the test then click on hyperlink then paste the destination post address then hashtag then anger name to angle one then click on apply if you want to open this article in a different page in a new page then go to link options by clicking on this gear button then check this open link in a new tab then update that's it